His first target is Marinero up high. That's where he's going. Boom! Marinero, uh-oh, score! Hector Marinero is a Cleveland sports legend, had an awesome mullet, and he had his own chocolate bar, appropriately named the Hector Marinero Crunch Bar. People ate it up, much like watching him score at will. Marinero is the all-time leading scorer in professional indoor soccer history, and he made sweet history, winning three championships with the Crunch in the 1990s. After he retired, he turned his focus to coaching, taking over a strong program at John Carroll University in 2006. This year, Coach Marinero helped the Blue Streaks win the OAC Tournament Championship. You know, I did get to win three championships as a player, um, but winning that uh, title on Saturday night with my son, the highlight of my career. Uh, quite honestly, I broke down and started crying. <laughs> yeah. So it's still emotional, and um, it's just been just to see him celebrate that, and it was awesome. When I first went up and hugged him, we were both very emotional, and I just said, I'm extremely proud of what we've done together and that I love him. For Hector Marinero, it's family first. He shares a deep bond with his son Jesse and the younger Marinero is following in his father's footsteps. Over the last two seasons, Jesse is John Carroll's leading scorer and he's the reigning conference midfielder of the year. I've always had to live up to the expectations. It's been tough, but um, I think I've done well for myself. So to be known as his son, a lot of people around the community know who I am. So uh, to be able to put together good performances really means a lot to me and my father. Hector Marinero made a name for himself in Cleveland and seeing what happened this year makes him proud to call Cleveland home. I absolutely love this city. Uh, this summer has been absolutely awesome with the Cavs and uh, I was at the parade, I was at, the, I was at game seven of the World Series and uh, you know, we experienced it a little bit with the crunch, you know, but very little compared to what it was this summer. And it was just so great to see the people of Cleveland with so much pride and, and passion with their sports teams. It, it was an awesome summer.